Hey. Hey. I got it. This time I got it. All right. It's hips. See, it's all in the hips. Uh -huh. Come through with the hips first. <laughs> that is out there. Got that. Joe's? No, supermarket. Well, is it good? It's, uh, it's okay. Well, let me taste that. Oh, see, that stinks. <laughs> you can't eat that. You should take that back. I'm not taking it back. All right, I'll take it back. I'm going by there. I don't care Jerry, about it. Jerry, you should care. Cantaloupe like this should be taken out of circulation. All right. <laughs> take it back. No. Leave a message. I'll call you back. Jerry, have you ever taken a bath in the dark? If I'm not talking into the soap right now, call me back. Uh, who's that? Marlene. Mar oh. Oh. Marlene. Yeah. I, I took her home one night. We kind of started up a little bit in the car. Well, I thought you were trying to get rid of her. I was, but she's got me, like, hypnotized or something. Did George know? No, he'd go nuts. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> I feel terrible. I mean, I've seen her a couple of times since then, and I know I can't go any further, but I, I just got, like, this psychosexual hold over me. I just want her. I, I can't breathe. It's like a drug. <sighs> psychosexual. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to tell him. <sighs> Man, I don't understand people. I mean, why would George want to deprive you of pleasure? Is it just me? It's partially you, yeah. I mean, you're his friend. I mean, better that she should sleep with someone else? Some jerk that he doesn't even know? Well, he can't kill me, right? You're a human being. I mean, she called me. I never called her. She started it. You're flesh and blood. I'm a nice guy. <laughs> <laughs>